what is up everybody welcome to the another video of sql injection series where i'll cover the last post based sql injection variant that is this particular thing great it says we have a valid credential for login page that is this particular thing let me just copy i'm not going to type now I'm too lazy to type something and password is passed so let's just hit enter and choose your zodiac sign okay i'll choose mine so first of all let me just turn the intercept on and from the drop down menu i'll choose taurus because that's what mine is let's just show me and we get a alert message that yes something is there and we get our request as usual we'll send it to the repeater in the repeater section will go and will tamper with the sign torus for that we'll just go and hit send we'll click on render and we can check the browser great now in torus we can just hit the semicolon and click on send and we get trying to get property in something as that and at last we get something went wrong get it right now we can check like or one equals to one and a hashtag this should give the horoscope of all the zodiac signs available that is leo aries sagittarius taurus virgo capricorn and so on now i look for the number of columns so uh, order by for example let me just write 51 so that i can understand what wrong it will send what error it will give me it will give me something went wrong okay let me just write 2 for example and it will show me the horoscope of my of Taurus so let's just write 5 it gives error that means the number of columns is less than 5 hit 4 it says wrong again hit 3 and here we get the horoscope that means the number of columns over here present is 3 so now what I can do is I can just write union select 1 comma 2 comma 3 let's see what columns are visible only column 3 is visible great now we can write like database click on send and the database name is SQL injection v8 okay so now I'll select database so I'll check for the table name basically from information underscore schema dot tables where table name is equals to SQL injection underscore v8 and on send we'll check did not give us anything did i do anything wrong information for the table so that table name oops it's not table name it's table schema actually my bad it's table schema i am shocked that it did not throw an error anyways so the name of the tables are horoscope and users so we are more much more inclined toward users table so now i'll hit backspace for table and then write this column from information schema dot columns where table schema is this okay and table name is users let's hit send we see the details are id username and password i mean the columns are id username and password and now we have to do a group on cat simple as that we have to write like group underscore con cat and to get the id username and password we'll just write like id is a gap comma the id then again we'll give a space sort of thing 
then we'll write like the username username is we get and we'll write username comma space comma password is to and password that's so id is id space username is this and space password is this and let me just increase the number of spaces so that things looks much more clear and from users basically right let me just clear all this thing all right this should give us the data and yes it does id is username id sorry id is one username is test.com password is this, this 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 and these are the data right great so i hope you understood this is all for today and see you on the next one where we'll cover auto loading page okay and this is very interesting this is going to be very interesting okay so see you on the next one have a good day and bye bye